Hello, welcome to my channel. My name is Aziza. I'm reading today for the sign of Virgo for love and relationship for the month of October 2024. This is for love and money, but we're going to read the love first, then the money. Virgo. In the beginning, start like your sister or one of your siblings is leaving their person or their marriage. That's a message here. Okay. It's all about like in your. Uh, you know, one of your siblings, like, you know, it could be a brother or a sister, like, you know, that they seek your attention, they need your help, and you cannot help them because you don't have it. And I get here, the coming a new love in your life. Aha! There is a new love coming in your life. And I get here, there is a person that is really annoying you the most. Currently in a relationship that... They are in a relationship, but they are not really in it. They wish to be, to continue with you, but you don't want to be really there with that person. And I get here, this person is coming to be not the new love yet. This person that you don't want them to continue with you. I get here that they are coming to help you out materially. So you will keep you, you will keep them or stay with you because they still want the home with you. They want really to stay with you. They want the relationship. This person loves you, but they have been really not feeling very well. They could be sick or ill. They wasted too much time and energy on addiction, drinking. They are not really there. Uh, They ignored your needs. They approach you, but they don't really, they are not supportive emotionally, mentally, physically. That's the current one. And you don't want to deal with them anymore. You want to, sh to shut the door. You don't want to give them attention. You don't want to help them. You don't want to be really taking care of them, which is you did help a lot. They did too, but you are tired. You don't want to spend any more time like you know, with this person because they drain you. They take all of your energy away. And I could hear that this person is not talking. They don't talk much. They don't really like to you know, look at you, what you are suffering, what you need and or want. The, the misunderstanding always between you two. I'm sorry to say it. Maybe they are always drunk. Or maybe... Or they could be not really a person who's drinking, like, you no know, a different situation. It could be, like, you know, not understanding anything. You don't really click on the same emotions mentally. Like, you were good together, but there is so much conflict. There are so many problems. And that person don't really get it or understand that they should or need to be more supportive and spend more time to, uh, with you to understand like, you know, what you need. At this current time, you feel like you, know, you want to block that person and you want to deal with a new relationship. There is a person who wants to be in your life and that person is really very nice. Understand your situation, know about it, and they don't mind you having maybe kids, children. They do understand what you are facing with a partner at this current time. And you don't want to really continue with that person. And I get here, this person really is playful for you. But you are hurting so much. There is so much damage deep inside you from the current relationship. Not the new love. 
that you are not enjoying the new love as you should be. You need to let go a lot from your heart against the person that was in the relationship or currently still around for you to enjoy the love, the playfulness. You feel like you know, that some kind of like you know, depressed, depression, unhappy, because the other person keep you like you no know, hurting because you keep expecting the current relationship to work. Let go of your expectations. You will be in birth. This will dissolve. This will go away. You are hurt because of your expectations, because you expect the person that you know already to be really better than that, to come around, to really be supportive and everything. They are not doing it. They are blocking it. This person blocking it for you. They are not doing it. They are not giving you what you want. Love. Maybe communications, maybe to spend time with you. Maybe they do, like, you know, maybe for a few moments, then they go away. Unless they open their mind about it. They made up their mind not to listen to you, not to give you anything you want. Unless this person, which is the current relations, not the new love, this person make up their mind not to open their mind about anything. Unless they change their mind, and want to cooperate with you and fix the relationship, then all of this is going to go away. So, in this situation right now, you need to say, I don't have any expectations from this person. Because if you expect and this person doesn't want to give it, you're going to be hurt and blocking your path, money situation, love situation, everything. And you, feel, you will feel emotionally drained and down. You are already emotionally drained and down from this person because they are not really giving you what you're supposed to have and this is when you have the bad luck because you keep maybe spying on them wants to know like know what's going on with them doubting yourself emotionally sad unhappy anxiety for goodness sake god forbid if you are pregnant you will have miscarriage okay you're afraid to rely on family. Maybe family have been really like you no know, supportive, but they cannot really all the time anyway. So you need to rely on yourself. If you are not working, you need to work. You need like you know, to seek really like you know how you can really make money. Because it sounds here like you, know, you have been really dependent very much blindly on other people. Not all of you Virgos, I'm not saying all of you are doing that. But if you are dependent on persons, don't expect them to be there 100% all the time because they are having financial problems too. We are in a time that between hit and miss. So, be careful about that. The, the current relationship he or she is not really changing. They don't want to progress. And they keep not progressing. And you want them to move away, to go away. They are not really being able to go away because of the shortage of money. They are working, but they spend their money on their pleasure more. Maybe alcohol, drugs, weed, pot, I don't know, whatever they are doing. It's up to them. That's their life. But you and this person are not really like you know, going okay. Bad luck in the family, to the relationship, insecurities between you two. It's not getting anywhere. Fights, arguments, all of that. At least you stop the argument. Either they want to walk away, this person, or he or she, like you know, say, 
I want to start with something, but they are worried that your situation with them is not going to change. That's why they haven't been really making the change and they are not ready to make it. So you are wasting your breath right now. I'm not saying forever to deal with this person and try and try and try and keep trying. Find your way right now and be happy. This person is looking for their own business, financial security they want. If they have a business like no, it's going to progress more. They, they have an increase of income and money situation coming to them. Other people like you know, seems to be that they are open to hire them for other jobs, businesses here and there. This person is a hard working person and they work really very well. That's why you are trying to encourage that person to really work. But you yell, you scream, maybe you hit, I don't know. It seems to be here, lower on your timber. Don't jump into conclusions a lot. And you have to take it easy on that person. You might be really accusing this person also that they have another relationship or have a lover. And that's why they may be not really being with you intimately or anything. Um, it doesn't sound to be like that, but it sounds like this person is afraid to continue or renew things that they want you to change personally about and you haven't been really doing it. I tell you, they are not ready. They are in a different, something in their star stars is going to change really later. It's not, they could be really water sign too. Yeah, that person is moody about paying your bills, walk away, have the upper hand, engagement to be really your husband or your wife or to be with you or not. They are not ready. Like They want to, but they are worried about it. I'm not saying they, they don't love you. They really do, but there is a lot going on between you two. Anyway, it seems here like you know, that you are trying harder right now with a new love. It could be an earth sign person like a Taurus. Capricorn, another Virgo, and there is a Gemini for others, and I could hear Leo for others also. Um, this is the new love. You're going to be really working on it, and you're beginning with this person. You want this, this person will, will do an effort with you. He or she will be the boyfriend, the girlfriend. You will feel great and awesome about it. You will have your confidence back. This person is really having all of this really like, you know, the intimacy, the sexual, like, you know, equal with you also the same way. And I get here that you will have the courage really to move forward. There are too many messages between you two. So that person is not really giving up on you. And I get here, but yet you have to make the choice. Let go the other person that you are having fights and arguments all the time for you to be really having this relationship with the other person. It could be someone like you know, that you deal with on social media, internet. You haven't been met, meeting with that person. Either is like you know, you know this person from you know your hometown, but this is a different situation in front of me here. And I get here that there is a new beginning. I don't know whom I'm picking on like you know really a Scorpio that maybe it didn't really work out between you two, but a water sign person like you know that. Uh, it could be Cancer, uh, it could be a Scorpio, Pisces. I see that it did not really work very well for you two at this current time. But there are some of you that you have a water sign person coming in your life. Like, don't be discouraged, you know, because every person is different, all right? Let's do work and career for Virgos for the month of October and see what's going on there. Work and career for Virgo for the month of October 
you might be relying, like you said earlier, on a business partner or, uh, or I'm sorry, on a, a partner to support you financially. And now you are confused if you change and walk away from that person, how your finances are going to be. It's not like you are not really getting an income from somewhere. You do. But it's not really good enough. And you feel like, if I want to walk away from this person, what's going to happen? Because you are really about really to uh, be with a new person in your life. And that is really, like, the personal is affecting the money situation. And I get here financially, you want really to make it on your own. You have a business idea. You have many multiple business ideas, like, you know, really that will increase your income without using or depending or relying on anybody. That will be really a happier support for yourself. But sometimes, like, you know, you are so scattered, you are in the, not in the mood, like, you know, to work or put really all of, together all of your, your thoughts, all of it together and put it into a business or a successful business. You are so scattered, worried, anxiety. I'm kind of like emotionally, mentally, like, you know, you are not really ready or preparing yourself for it because of too many problems that happen between you and someone that you know already which is the partner or the one that you are walking away from. So it says here that you want to get away like you know, from everybody at this current time. You want, but something is keep, you have a talent on you or a career on you, something that you are really very good at. You want to walk away from it, but something keep pulling you to it. And you are kind of like discouraged about the whole idea because you don't want to be really dealing with people and pleasant people or a situation you are worried about that and i get here that things are not going to be going as planned unexpected changes or obstacles for you hmm. if you have been off the path you will come back strong very good in business it's better for you to have your own business a lot of you, if you don't have the money for it, sometimes you open a business and or you enter a business that you don't have to be, like, you know, really having um, money or lots of money. But there are new ideas or teaching the public with something or something to do on the internet or over maybe YouTube that you are going to be really making money. But sometimes you feel like you know, that you enter it, you are not really so committed that's the problem you're not committed you want to go out you want to really do other things like you know you don't want to be really just sitting there to do it okay you wonder if you should really pause everything like you know and not really to do anything at this current time or not to walk away from your partner or not to receive that new love no continue on the path and I get here, you feel like you want to make videos or something to really have your own business. There is an increase of money and finances coming your way and you're going to be really very busy. Virgo, you're capable of doing a lot. Money have been really slow for you, not going. Emotional problems have been there. But I get here from now on. If you decide on leaving that person that giving you new heartache and become like no really in the new relationship, you will have multiple appetite just to work on that new business and do it and money is going to be flowing in your life. Take a pick, make a choice, it's up to you what to do. I see success for you along the run, dear Virgo. You can accomplish a lot. See, I picked up those like no randomly, and it says here, and you love, it could be the Taurus here, huh? Or an earth sign person. It could be like, you know, some people like, you know, that you are establishing a love or a relationship with someone who is very important or in a good position also, financially independent, or it could be your boss. Or somebody like, you know, that could be a manager somewhere. Beautiful. If somebody you rely on financially and giving you all of this heartache, you don't need to. Walk away and you will have extra money actually. It's coming your way. 
Best of luck for you, dear Virgo. I hope you enjoyed the reading. And if you need a private reading, please contact me. The link for my website is below this video, mysticalaziza.com. After you click on reading prices, please purchase your reading. Then give me a call. And my phone number is listed on my website. And thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye.